Cats' eyes can't focus closer than one foot ahead, so they use their whiskers to tell them what's going on right in front of their noses. The whiskers are attached to touch receptors that relay how far and fast they're being bent back, giving Puss a 3D impression of the world around him. As the whiskers are roughly the same width as the cat's body, they allow him to judge whether he'll have trouble negotiating a gap or if he'll be able to easily pass through. Without those super-sensitive whiskers, negotiating obstacles like the humble cat flap would be nigh on impossible. And our moggies would be resigned to a life of hanging out on doorsteps or looking for alternative ways in. Well, oh, that'll do. But there is one small flaw when it comes to cats and their flaps. Their whiskers may have evolved to be the same width as their bodies, but if Kitty is, how should I put it, larger boned, then his girth will soon outgrow his whiskers. This means that Pussy's head may easily pass through the flap, whilst the rest of his body may be more of a squeeze. Looks like somebody's had all the cream. This task is made so much harder when Mog can't push with those muscular back legs. The cat's owner might take this as a sign that it's time to put Puss on a diet. But some cats shed weight quicker than others. So whilst they're losing the pounds, they keep on squeezing through. But let's face it, Big is beautiful.